Hello! Today I'll show you how to fix any broken 3.5mm headphone jack. This time, the jack is broken on the Sennheiser HD300 headphones. It's a simple way to bring your headphones back to life without buying new ones. To do this, you will need a soldering iron kit, a heat shrink tubing set, and some basic tools. The first step is to cut off the damaged jack, then stretch the cable gently from the headphone side to the end. This will improve the cable's lifespan. Next. Cut a piece of heat shrink tubing slightly larger than the cable and slide it onto the cable. You'll also need a replacement jack. The link to the new jack is in the video description. Start by carefully removing the outer jacket of the cable, but be careful not to damage the inner wires. Separate the wires by color and cut away the fabric threads. To figure out which wire is for the left, right, and ground, you may need to open the headphone housing. Remove the ear pad on the side where the cable enter the headphones and unscrew the ear cup. Inside, you'll find the wiring color for this model. Keep in mind that wire colors can vary between different headphones. Once you've identified the correct color layout, reassemble the headphone housing and put the ear pad back on. If you need help with replacing worn out ear pads, check my previous video. Now, twist together the gold and green wires. Both are grounds, which are common on a 3.5 millimeter jack. Tin all the wires with solder. The ground wire should be tinned along its full length. Also, tin all the contacts on the new jack. This improves soldering quality and makes the process easier. Cut the ground wire to the correct length and solder it to the right contact. Then use pliers to press the jack's cable clamp around the cable to secure it in place. This helps the cable last longer. Next, tin the blue wire left speaker plus and solder it to the correct contact. Do the same with the red wire right speaker plus. Be very careful when soldering to avoid short circuits between contacts. Otherwise, the headphones won't work and you'll need to redo the repair. For extra protection, you can use nail polish on the jack contacts to prevent short circuits in the future. Add a small amount of superglue where the cable is secured in the clamp. Then, slide the heat shrink tubing over it and shrink it in place. This gives the repair strong support and durability. Finally, add a bit of superglue to the contact area and heat shrink tubing. Screw the jack housing together and the repair is done. But, since this is the tech screw channel, I'll also show you how to make it look even better. Take a slightly longer piece of heat shrink tubing that's just smaller than the jack housing. Stretch it with pliers so it fits over the housing. Then, add super glue where the cable enters the jack, slide the tubing over the housing, and shrink it in place. This gives the cable extra reinforcement and a professional look, just like from the factory. And here's the final result a fully repaired 3.5mm jack on these Sennheiser headphones. This technique works for repairing almost any headphones with a damaged jack. Good luck, and as always, I'll be happy to see your comments or a like on this video.